We've had a lot of questions. There was somebody in, the, in our Facebook group that asked about uh, extension of the I-129F approval. So if you're going through the fiance visa process, um, you know that you had filed an I-129F petition. When you get that approval, it'll show that it's valid for four months and that petition has to actually be renewed. And so we have other videos on our YouTube channel that goes through the process of how to extend that approval date from those four months to extend it for another four months. Uh, essentially, you would be asking the U.S. Embassy or Consulate where your interview um, will be will be held to extend that petition. And typically you do that by by email requesting that extension. So the question that was asked was, oh, my gosh, um, my I-129F approval is expiring really soon. Um, what, what's going to happen if it expires? I haven't heard from the U.S. Embassy or Consulate yet. So right now, because of COVID, they're automatically extending your um, an approved I-129F. So that means they're automatically extending the, that four months. However, as a, a rule of thumb, our, our office still asks for that extension. So we email the U.S. Embassy or Consulate letting them know we are still, our, our client is still interested in pursuing uh, the I-129F, the fiance visa, and asking for that extension. Most U.S. embassies and consulates will not respond to you, but we like to send that email to memorialize that we've asked for that extension and, and keep that in our file, just to have proof that we asked for that extension, even though they're automatically extending um, the I-129Fs. Just because immigration, <laughs> for all of you who are going through it, you know that it's crazy, and so it's always good to just be extra safe and, and still ask for that extension. Um, uh, of that I-129F uh, petition approval. And then when you actually go to your U.S. interview, U.S. embassy or consulate interview, um, the officer will, will confirm that that petition has been extended. And they really are very generously extending those um, because it's an automatic extension because unfortunately uh, COVID happened to, the, to our world and has really shook things up. So don't panic if your I-129F petition is about to expire. Just send that email to U.S. Embassy or Consulate, um, letting them know you'd like to extend it, but also have peace of mind knowing it's automatically extended.